I just hope you are doing good and enjoying life. Uh, welcome back to my channel, the Alien Tech Champion. Today, today I am going to talk about the, how you can add, how you can add the wave links or wave URL to the managed Google Play Store. Most people actually they know for iOS, but uh, I will show you for Android, right? For iOS, it's quite easy. So in this video, if you are new to this uh, Microsoft Intune ecosystem. So this is Microsoft Endpoint Portal <coughs> for iOS devices, right? It's quite easy. You can click on Apps and then click on iOS and add, select the Wave Wave link and select the link and give the link name, right? Your like your company, something like your company, Internet Intra Intranet link or URL, whatever you want. You can put anything. Uh, the, your link should be accessible from the phone right of course like suppose I am selecting um, anything uh, company intranet company intranet dot com right all this company have all this you know so you, you want to um, create um, you want to open this link uh, in a managed browser if it's yes of course it will open with the edge browser only managed browser or into managed browser right so it's recommended if you select yes then it will open with the man if you don't want to open if it's uh, publicly ex accessible then you can select no but it's recommended to select yes category you can define the productivity if you want to show this application in uh, feature app in the company portal select yes or it's no just give it name okay it's asking for the because it's recommended publisher of course your company name you can give the company name okay and click next you can just select the scope here <coughs> by default and then select next and you want to push force force to all the users just select all the devices if you want to just available for all the users just select available for all the users and click next that's it very simple for iOS it's quite simple but for Android right I'm gonna show you so I have published this for uh, wavelength for iOS devices you see wavelength is published but let's talk about the Android let's go to the Android it's quite different go to the app section add and what is wavelength right just click wavelength right now this is not correct so if you create this uh, by selecting this other wavelength it will only apply if if your device is enrolled as a device administrator so what you have to do how you can publish this wavelength for android enterprise devices because intune supports android enterprise devices right so where you have to go you have to go to the manage google play store don't confuse so don't publish if you publish here it will not show for the android enterprise devices which is enrolled as a kobo method or work profile or cope method so you have to click on manage google play store select here and it will come before that as i have mentioned in my previous video you have to integrate the google play integration with your intune tenant come on <coughs> oh. okay sorry manage google play store select next come on coming okay I think it has some issue or maybe I have some internet uh, connection uh, so it's manage Google Play Store click on next and it's a wait for a few seconds so you see here uh, I have uh, in the manage Google Play Store manage Google Play wave links are installable and manageable just like the other Android apps right it's will similar like android apps when install on a devices they they will appear in the user app list catalogs alongside the other apps they have installed when selected they will launch in a device web browser so we link push down to the managed google play store will not open in the corporate context of the microsoft s if you configure your into an application production policy so when the wave link is pushed down to your managed google play so it's not recognized as a mam managed applications right so you see here a wave link will open with Microsoft Ace or any other app 
you choose to deploy be sure to deploy at least one browser to the devices in order for wavelength to be open properly right however all of the display options will available for the wavelength full screen on will work in the chrome browser right so if you see here same thing we are doing store apps uh, it came and here if you just most people actually they don't know they just keep searching right so here you have to do uh, if you want to publish in my previous video i have shown you for private application if you have line of business applications like I apk file you can upload the private apk file and wave applications here create wave applications here what do you have to do you have to click plus sign and give it name your android wave apps android or wave apps okay and give it the company your right company android wave apps.com right and you configure if you want to open full screen mode minimum ui of course or standalone and you can upload the icon and icon should be here right in uh, 512 px square create this that's it so if you create or publish this wave link in manage google play store this your intranet company url or wave link uh, will be available on on your managed mdm devices which is enrolled through corporate owned personally enabled or company owned business enabled right fully de dedicated and this application will be since i have not uploaded the logo so it's not there so and it's available it will be the main as google play store right it will not show here right you see so this is the difference of so don't confuse between this wave link and manage google play store if you want to publish this any wave link for android enterprise mdm enroll devices you have to click on manage google play store if you publish in this uh, other wave link then it will not show in your android enterprise devices it will show if your device is as a device admin which is actually deprecated we are not using that into not support in fact so so now you have learned how you can publish the wave links for the android enterprise devices whether it's enrolled through kobo coop or any method work profile and then user will able to see the wave link on the on their devices in manage google play stores i hope uh, uh you learn uh, for more information of course you can go to the learn.microsoft.com and see uh, how you can publish this application in details but i have shown you so this video should be enough for you thank you have a good day bye bye